Thank you, uh, thank you, Chairman Cox, and uh, and good morning. Uh, San Diego's success in confronting the coronavirus pandemic uh, has and always will be a collaborative one. Uh, it is about us coming together as a community, about us working together, uh, about us taking actions uh, that help the broader community. Uh, Rady's Children's Hospital has always been a place of world-class quality care. It's always been a place of compassion, uh, of love. It has always been a, a wonderfully welcoming part to take care of our children, uh, the overwhelming majority from San Diego County. But they've also always been a community partner. Uh, whether we were working together on behavioral health issues or mental health issues, uh, they've always been willing to step up in significant ways uh, to be a good partner, to be a good neighbor, to be a good friend to each and every San Diegan. Mm -hmm. And today's announcement of the COVID Collaborative for Children uh, with Rabies Children Hospital is another example uh, of their commitment to our community. Uh, this collaboration, this coordination, this effort we're doing uh, is a cornerstone, a foundational part of our T3 strategy at the county. Uh, we talk a lot about as we come out of the end of the next phases of the coronavirus pandemic, uh, it remains there until such time as we have a vaccine or a therapeutic treatment, it remains a danger. And so what we are trying to do every day is mitigate the risk, slow the spread, ensure that our health system capacity is there. In order for that to be accomplished, we need the general public to adhere to things like face coverings, temperature checks, hand washing, physical distancing, but we also need a robust testing, tracing, and treatment strategy. The first of those T's is testing. And the fact that Rady is, is in the process of being able to stand up up to 2,000 tests a day for children and their families each day from across San Diego County will help us greatly in better detecting the early cases of coronavirus positives and then be able to get to work tracing those close contacts, checking those individuals, and properly isolating those who are positives. And this collaboration and partnership is what we hope will give us a smooth re-entry and smooth process out of this, but we would not be able to do it if we're not for the incredible uh, collaboration and partnership from agencies like Rady's Children's Hospital. Each testing uh, that we are able to do uh, makes us more aware of the situation on the ground. It makes us more aware as an early indicator of positive cases, uh, and it makes us more able to continue our forward progress uh, through our coronavirus response and recovery efforts. Uh, Radius Children's Hospitals, as was mentioned earlier, is the provider of care to a significant majority of the entire county's children. They will provide these tests to their youth patients, their parents, their caregivers uh, across this network. Additionally, they've invited other healthcare systems to participate in the COVID Collaborative for Children uh, and make the same test available uh, to those entities, children, and their family. We've uh, all learned a great deal about coronavirus testing, about the multiple components that go into it. Uh, if it was as easy as a pregnancy test, uh, we would be able to ramp up much, much, much more quickly. But the reality is there are so many individual components or pieces that go into executing a single test. And so to have Rady step up and say, we will shoulder the load on getting all of those components and all of those pieces together in a systematic way, in a substantial way, uh, in a way that helps our children and their families is a great testament uh, to Rady's, to their commitment, and to the ongoing collaboration that we have. Uh, at the county, we're willing to be a part of it. We recently set aside a significant amount uh, of our CARES Act funding for testing, tracing, and treatment, uh, and we will stand here to help and assist Rady's as they go forward with this. Uh, but again, when we talk about our initial goal of getting to 5,000, roughly 5,000 tests per day, uh, the progress we've made as this continues to come online, we think this is a significant part of our regional approach and strategy. And so I want to uh, congratulate uh, Radies for putting this together, for pulling it off, for making it happen, uh, and let them know that at the County of San Diego, we stand as their partner and their ally uh, and their collaborator, because again, we are all in this together. And so to Dr. Frias, the CEO, and Doug Hutchinson, the chair of the board, uh, and to every individual person at Rates who makes this happen, every nurse, every doctor, every lab technician, uh, every person who is involved in ordering supplies and testing machines and coordinating the scheduling and the arrangements to every one of the thousands of people that go into making something like this happen, uh, you have our eternal gratitude. 